So, we have impregnated our slices for 24 hours and we reach the final uh, vacuum pressure of 4 tor or 4 millimeter mercury column. If uh, we reach this final end uh, pressure, that means our slices are impregnated, that means all the solvent was dragged out of the slices and replaced, impregnated by E12. We can see that uh, we have only a few big bubbles rising up, no small bubbles which will be uh, acetone or maybe methylene chloride depending on which uh, volatile intermedium we uh, have used. So uh, the main idea is 24 hours impregnation reaching a final uh, uh, pressure of at least 5 millimeter mercury column. After impregnation is finished, we have to stop the vacuum uh, pressure, we have to stop our uh, vacuum pump, uh, open the valves, let air go in, open our impregnation uh, butt, lift the impregnation butt outside and place it nearby and go to the casting step. If we have stopped, after 24 hours, we have to cast the slices immediately. The epoxy resin is actually a mixture, a mixture between a resin and a hardener. And this reaction is not to be stopped. Once started, it will get hard in time. So, after 24 hours, you have to cast your slices immediately. You can't keep it somewhere in cold or dark the next two days because you will get a block. The main idea is once you reach the final pressure after 24 hours, start with casting. <laughs>